in this space up here, you should say what you used. If you used two centimeters was equal to one, that's what you would write here. If you made your grid three, four, or five centimeters is equal to one centimeter, mm -hmm. that's what you need to put here. Down here for original size, you're going to take your comic strip and count how many spaces across did it go. So in mine, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then you're going to look at how many centimeters your new one is. When I drew mine, I used a two centimeters is equal to one centimeter scale. That means that when my larger one was drawn, this was times two. When we're talking about proportions, we have to set this up to show the percent that it was enlarged. We would put what in the top here? Original or enlarged? What goes on the top? The new or the enlarged. What goes on the bottom? The original. Okay. I actually want you guys to cross this off. I adjusted this from um, what we used last year. And I'd like you to put a reflection here. This is where you're writing about what it was like to do this project. Okay? And again, one more time at the bottom, you're going to write what your scale factor is. In the reflection, you can include things about what was challenging for you, what part of the project you enjoyed, did you have to start over again, anything you think that I should know about your personal progress with this project. I would like to see your original comic strip taped onto your enlarged one, and then these two things should be stapled together. Okay? Um, I would prefer it if you put this on top because your name is going to go here and this underneath because it will kind of keep this protected as we turn them in so that other people's papers don't pop your comic strip off. Okay? So the artwork is going to get stapled underneath the math part of it and it's going to get turned in today.